more new viewers than subscribers. So you know in the past we talk about all the guns and all the gunmen them that used to be in St. James that leaving St. James and going to other parishes now other parishes are gonna feel the heat, you know, all well, the killings gonna start going on in them parish. Yeah. So no fun of mine say St. Anne, you know, the garden parish. So I've recently we see like a flare up start going on killing start going on in center and center one of them you probably can report maybe say 10 murders well 10 to 40 murders that's a lot still but you don't really hear about center and having that much murder you understand don't really hear about them having that much murder you know something because center is so quiet you know, a lot of people try to move a lot of people from Kingston and then places that try, you know, they pretty much want to like retire. You let us move, come and center and find a little place and build up and you know enjoy the rest of your life. Just like how a lot of people come from Florida and come retire, which to them is a retirement state. Anyways. I've recently we see them have a little flare up of killing from Runner Bay to Brownstone. You know, at a shooting, it was about three persons died recently, and then we have yesterday a Chinese businessman was killed in Brownstown. Now they catch the alleged assailant, you know, alleged assailant, maybe char and charge him. They don't, you know, still on a questioning. So they still on questioning, but they might charge him same time. Because them say him do it. I don't know how them find out so quick. That's what them say. So now, when you work for the Chinese people in Jamaica, you know you don't get a lot of pay. You understand? Them, you probably get about $3,500 a week, if so much. Three, five, every week or every day. Yeah, I think it's every week. I don't, I'm not sure on the numbers. But, what do you think would cause this person to go kill a Chinese man? Well, you see that I get not getting money, you want to raise up here. Or somebody just don't like him and put a hit on him. You understand? As I said before, hit for hire is a thing in Jamaica. You probably just don't like a person, a man probably just put out a hit on you and just slap you away for less than nothing you can get one out of 50 US dollar the man will just take your life just like that because your life means nothing to nothing at all you know and it's as I said it's sad but it does happen all over not just Jamaica but you know Jamaica we come from some of the I know from Jamaica and it's just sad so it's just an update man to see you know tell you that you guys know what's going on in and about in Jamaica not just in St. James or you know Kingston or you know Clarendon and all those places where you know they have the high crime rate you know the little smaller ones to have incidents going on also I know a lot of people from St. Anne to right now Brownstone to Runner Bay pretty much to watch it in a an alert right now because as I said they don't have that much killing yes you might have gun killings at per se you have other killings you have man with stab up man because you don't know that most people from the country you know yeah man with chop up with them last and all them things just stuff like that but gun related incidents you know everybody's kinda of alert if you know say yo Gangsters them move from one from one place to the other. You know them are come in a country now, come do them biddings. So it's a matter of time before now seconds I did already, you know. I never said that. But you're gonna have a lot of killings might be taking places in these areas. So I want if you have family members, you know, friends in these areas, you know. Just tell them to be careful when they go out, you understand? Because 
these places are starting to get hot. So just to be on the alert. Because I think the person was just driving by and I don't know if none of you guys have ever been to St. Time like going towards Brownstone. Going to Brownstone. There's a little bridge. We just say at the flat bridge, I run every beer going towards Brownstone. And you know, it's kind of a little traffic jam right there. So if a car come, you have to wait till the other car come and then pass the bridge then before you can go on the bridge. Two cars can go on the bridge at the same time. So I guess one of the, the other person were waiting at the bridge and they just come bam 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 and kill them right there on the spot. So I'm gonna say be careful when you're driving. When you're driving also man, lock your doors. You know, driving lock your doors. Don't leave your door. Just press the automatic lock inside while you're driving because you don't want a body to just drive up in your car, open your door, come into your car and you know do any form of killing, just kill try to kill you or anything like that. As I said, that stuff do happen. So I just want you guys to be on the alert. And then you know, like, share, comment, subscribe. You guys have a blessed morning. Alright? As I said, be on the alert. If you have friends and family in these areas, just like I always said in, in other areas, tell them to be careful. Just the same thing again. Alright guys, you have a blessed morning again.